giving me the stare. Say please, please, please don't go away. You say I'm giving you the blues. My bad. My father took pride in saying that he ran our house like a tight ship. The ship got a lot looser when my Mima came over to babysit. I bet a nickel. Hang on there a minute, Moonpa. I want to teach you something. Look at your cards, and then look in the mirror. Hey, I'm smiling. Uh-huh. And what does that tell me about your cards? That I like them? At a boy. Now. Look at my face. Tell me what you see. That you're old. It's a good thing I love you. I'm gonna look at my cards again. You're unhappy. Which means? You don't have good cards. Mm-hmm. So, I'm gonna see you, Nickel, and raise you a quarter. Quarter? You can fold. No, I have good cards. You have bad cards. I'm in. Nines and fives. Mm, that's too bad. Three queens. You lose! <laughs> what? But you weren't happy. I made you think I was unhappy. But that's lying. You lied to your moon pie. I bluffed my moon pie. Do people know about this? Sheldon, what's on a person's face is not always what's in their heart. Well, this changes everything. How do you know who to trust? You don't. That's what makes life interesting. Mima liked to teach me things that kept me awake at night. Mom, we're home. In here. What's he doing up? Losing. Hell is that? I sent Georgie on a beer run and tipped him with firecrackers. Oh, Mom. Was I supposed to stiff him? Okay. They're all yours. <laughs> we have a few minutes before first period. I need y'all to fill out these forms. What? Also in violation of the grooming code on page 48, article five, subsection B, you have a bit of a mustache. <laughs> this is a stupid idea. This boy does not belong in our school. Come on, Vicky. it's just the first day. Why don't we all just take a deep breath here? The hell with that. Five minutes into my math class, he questioned my credentials. How am I supposed to control a classroom when a kid accuses me of being in breach of the hygiene code? Well, Hebert, it wouldn't kill you to shower a little more often. George, you want to weigh in here? Well, Oral Roberts University is a wonderful school. He said I was intimidated by his intelligence, and then he offered to be my leader. Okay, the problem is the curriculum here is not challenging enough for Sheldon. Now, he gets bored and maybe doesn't express himself in the most productive way. And so the square of sine plus cosine equals one. Sheldon. I don't want to embarrass you, so I'm going to give you a moment to think about what you just said. Ms. McElroy? What? I'm wondering if you read the book you assigned to us, because I did. 20 laps. Koopa? If you're going to ask us to run, don't you think you should lead by example? You're saying he's being rude to his teachers? That's unacceptable. I'll, I'll give him a talking to. I don't know if I'd call him rude. Well, put a word on it. Rude. Let's go with rude. I mean, why'd I bother becoming a teacher? He knows what I'm gonna say before I say it, or I say it and look like a dumbbell. Ms. Ingram, can I offer a suggestion? What? Never mind, you do it your way. No, no, you tell me. Tell me how I'm wrong. You assumed an extra axiom of Euclidean geometry without stating it. Was he right? Of course he's right. <laughs> he's always right. <laughs> Tell you what I do. I send him on the little errands, like the other day. I told him, go to the supply room and get me a frame of stamp. <laughs> What's a frame of stamp? No such thing. I made it up. <laughs> <laughs> he was gone the whole feeling. <laughs> Genius. I'm using that. <laughs> Don't use friends, then. That's mine. <laughs> What's going on here? 
You said he was going away. Liar. It's 11 o'clock in the morning, guys. <laughs> <laughs> because this was the weekend. I got to do my parents' taxes. Howdy do W2. Dad, banking question. What's that, buddy? I noticed there's a check missing. I have a copy of check 128 and a copy of check 130, but 129 isn't there. Yeah, don't worry about it. But I enjoy worrying. I find it very relaxing. Of course you do. I balance the rest of the account, and it appears to be a check for $300. All right, well, let's just put it down for $300 for miscellaneous. I've never labeled anything miscellaneous in my life. I'll go ask Mom. Wait. <laughs> I just remembered. Yeah. I gave the money to a friend. Who? It doesn't matter who. Why'd you give it to them? They needed it. it it's like charity. Ooh, another write-off. Excellent. Hey, hey, hey. So what do you say we keep this quiet? You mean like a secret? No, no, just you know, something between you and me. What about Mom? Mom is on a need-to-know basis. What if Mom needs to know? Okay, it's a secret. Just trust me. It is better for everyone if she doesn't know about this. But I'm not good at keeping secrets. It's not hard. Just keep your mouth shut. But I'm not good at keeping my mouth shut. Sheldon, all you gotta do is be cool. Be cool. You might as well have asked me to fly around the backyard. Hello. I was just brushing my teeth like I do every night. Haha, <laughs> nothing new there. You all right? Yes, I'm cool. I'm very cool. Tell Shadow what cool means. Hush. Sweet dreams. Love you. Love you too, because you're my mom. <laughs> to avoid looking suspicious, I tried to interact with my mom as little as possible. Thankfully, it's rude to speak with your mouth full. You look tired, baby. Sleep okay? Mm-hmm. So how big a tax refund you think we're gonna get? Mm. Morning. Morning. I slept in the nude last night. Felt every little breeze. Thank you for sharing that. You're welcome. We got any batteries? Look in the drawer by the refrigerator. There was only so much food I could eat, so I started avoiding my mother whenever possible. What are you doing in there? Keeping your secret. Thank you. Batteries are in this drawer. 